That's one of the girls from the washroom. <sighs> you, come. Yes, I'm talking to you. Follow me. Pass it. Hey. Sisters, please, I can explain. I think okay. St. Nicholas likes you. <laughs> You're actually right. Don't be naive. Can't you see the way he stares at you sometimes? Exactly. I thought I was the only one who noticed that. See, Sek Nicholas is just trying to help me out because he thinks I'm a bitch to me, and that's all. Help you? Yeah. Because you are his relative or his teacher of the year. So My dear, there's no freelance. Trust me. You're always thinking negative. Besides, he has not said or done anything to show he's interested in me. Ayo! Besides, I know you love to have some, some sweets while prep. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? And that's fat mama following him. Get uh, you a boyfriend uh -huh. who gets you airtime, buys you provisions and other stuff. You know snacks during prep. Let me even check out for my boy. You took the phone to class. Today you'll be caught eh? <laughs> I won't get caught. The phone is always on silent. And I only take it when I want to make important calls. Don't say I don't tell me. Oh, two missed calls from my boy. Let me call him back. Uh -huh. Hello, baby. Hi. I'm not sure. Um, I just closed from class. I'm heading towards my house now. What about you? I'm on my way to lectures. Um, remember Saturday is visiting and you said you were going to come. Charlie, I know, but something came up. But you promised. My cousin is coming from the US, you know, America. Charlie, so you have to do some small party for him. Oh, really? Look, I would love to take you. What do you say? Come on, let's go. Really? But I don't think I can get an exit within such a short meeting. But you big girl like yourself, you still didn't hear exit before you come out. Okay, I'll see what I can do about it. All right, all right. Okay, so I forgot the lecture hall. We'll talk later. Yeah, my sugar chopsticks. All right, sure. Bye. Hey, so hey. it was just you and Sir Nicholas in that office? No. We were with our ancestors. Do you have a problem? <laughs> And you should have listened to your mother just did. And don't say I'm the bad one. Ah, uh, wait. Were we doing anything bad when you guys came? Ah, you should be careful. You can't be alone, like all alone in that room with him alone. It's risky. Did you look at his face when he said he didn't have a girlfriend? Tell her. Okay. I'll be careful. I've heard you guys. Jo, when it's coming, then it's doing. Hey, look who he's talking. Anyways, I need you girls to escort me to Iron Lady's place. I have to go and sign my ex yard. Are you still bent on going for this party? <gasps> it's an American burgers party. Mm. Best believe it, this party is going to be lit. Do you think Iron Lady will grant you permission on such short notice? Leave Iron Lady to me. Other than that, I might just have to beat immigration. You mean jump the wall? <laughs> you must be crazy, right? She's dear. crazy. What's up? So what happened? I told you she wasn't going to call. Say something. Nice. What's it? How did you do this? Let me see. As soon as I saw her coming, mm -hmm. I started to shiver and pretend as if I was seriously sick. Mm -hmm. And she also fell for it. Seriously. What's wrong? I don't know what's wrong with me. I've been feeling feverish this whole week. Let me see. Oh yes, you are burning hot. Uh, Tilly, yes, you need to go to the hospital. I've spoken to mommy and she asked me to come home. Really? Yes, my love. Ah, okay. You know I can't just sign the exit like that. You have to write a permission letter first. And uh, you know, I need to confirm with your mother whether she actually asked you to come home. Um, <laughs> and write her telephone number at the end, okay? Yes, yeah. <laughs> um, Wait, come. Bring it. Yeah. 
Make sure you bring a hospital report on your return, okay? All right. Yes, I wish you a speedy recovery. Thank you. And she was like, I wish you a speedy recovery, my dear. And I was like, thank you, madam. I really can't believe she fell for this. Like, I told you she was going to do this. You are such a good actress. This is what I have always been telling you. Mm -hmm. I can't wait for the whole world to know how talented I actually am. Oh yeah, we know you are. Then no one sees so we must go with the gun cow. Put up a Wonder, still them I wonder. I know you don't know things, but I don't know what I'm looking for. As I show you love, you can show me back. But you don't have to make a fall and sand that put me back as you need. What time is party? You know what? I need to come. I need come right now. Yeah, I want to come one more time back in. See? Wonder. Then I wonder. Oh, eh, eh, eh. Then no one sees the wind, but still we don't come down. Are you also? Aren't you going for the party? The party will be more back here. Tomorrow? I thought you said it was tonight. Yeah, tonight me then we go figure one our own private party. No. What be no? See, come make a treat you. Mm. No. Why are you like that? I'm a virgin. You be what? Virgin. So all the naughty phone calls and things all. I'm sorry if I gave you a wrong impression, but I'm saying the truth. <laughs> so what? As you they come here and I think say what? Will they come do Bible studies or what? I thought you were just kidding. There's a first time to everything. Yeah, they come. No, um, you, we can wait till we get married before we do. Please be patient. Marriage. Charlie, I'm not sick. We are go get patient too. See. As they come here, or now you watch if you can see what they come do. No, you did your work. So just relax. No. Come. What be no? No. Maya will be number one. To bench. Go now. Thank Stop God. Yourself. You're back. We've been worried. We tried calling your line several times. I've just had the worst experience ever in my life. No happens. You nearly go rain. By who? How? Where? Slim. <sighs> At the hotel. But I thought you said you were going for a party. Yeah, apparently the party was the next day, which is today. So what were you doing in the hotel room? Why didn't you just come back to school? I just thank God nothing happened and he let me go. And he didn't even pay for the hotel room, so I had to give out my phone as payment. You are very lucky he didn't do anything to you. But all this is partly your fault. How? The way you carry yourself around, they sent out all kinds of signals. Yeah, you're right. Are you still a baby? <laughs> yeah, but you can't tell anyone. Wow. Mm. Anyways, have you eaten? No. Some conflicts. Some balanced diet. Hey, hi guys. Good afternoon. Good afternoon. Where have you been? I came to your class. I went to see Sir Nicholas. Sir who? Nicholas. Ah, you this girl. Ah, it's not like I just went to see him to. Help me with my assignment, that's all. So, have you done the assignment? Hmm, no. He said he's going out. He'll be back in about an hour. So, I don't have much of a choice. I have to go to his place to do my assignment. His place? As in his house? Yeah. Do you really have to go there? Uh, it's Mr. Samuel's assignment. Ah, but that man too, are not day students in your class? But anyway, I don't think you should go there on your own. Take us with you. Hey, you can see the look on his face. He looked like he was disappointed. I bet he wasn't expecting us to come along. I could have imagined if we didn't go with him, what would have happened? Yeah. Okay, so are we going to watch the game now with? Yeah, why not? I bet somebody doesn't want to watch her exes play. <laughs> Seriously. Yeah, but we are not going if we are not. So. Seriously. Yeah. yeah. Let's go. Okay, I think they are here. Hello? 
Are you here? Okay, come in. Uh, are they here? Yeah, they are. Oh, okay. Hi, baby girl. Hi. What's going on? She says she has a shoot. Again. I know, right? Are you sure it's just a shoot she's doing? Baby girl, whether it's an affair or it's professional, it's up to the two of them, okay? Right. Awesome. You must be Ariana. Yes. Hmm. Don't worry, Tilly's my oldest friend and she tells me everything about you. Wow. Um, she never said anything about you to me. <gasps> Tilly, you never told your friend about I mean, me? I mean, technically... I'm hurt, I'm hurt, I'm hurt, okay? Anyways, since she didn't tell you about me, I am a care Gucci. And you're welcome to my fabulous life. Thank you. You're welcome, you're welcome. Anyway, so um, where are the boys? She told me that your boyfriend and his friends would be here. So where are they? You told her? Honestly, I don't think these boys are going to come. Why don't you text or them to ask why they've taken so long? No, I'm not going to do that. It's gonna come across us as being desperate. Look, if your boyfriends are not gonna come, I suggest we go to the poolside and chill. I mean. Sure, why not? Yes, let's go right now. Okay, let me get my stuff here. Ariana. Oh, hi. What's up? Mm, nothing really. Few days to your bed. Bro. I know, oh, right? Wait. I can't wait either. Anyway, uh, Ikea Gucci says we're going for dress shopping after classes today. Cool, but where does she get all that money to buy the fancy stuff she's been buying? Are you sure Sheka is really her uncle she claims? Listen, with Ikea, you never really get the full story. So you don't have to worry yourself about it. Just. Oh, with the friendship. That's it. That's what's important. Well, I don't want anyone to do anything uncomfortable because of me. Ha! <laughs> don't worry about it, Pia. She's not going to do anything she's not comfortable with. And that reminds me, how is Flex sponsoring the party? Don't look at me. It was not my idea. And you agree to it. It doesn't mean I'm going to date him. But I think, what if he starts making demands? Like, definitely, he's not going to do it for free. I don't know. It's kind of disappointed you. I wasn't really expecting you to do this. Agree to flex. You let her influence you. I told you it was not my idea. I'm really disappointed. But what about Mark Anthony? What about him? What if he finds out your ex-boyfriend is the one sponsoring the party? How do you think you feel about it? You ask too many questions, Martha. And for your information, Mark Anthony is not her boyfriend. Silly baby. I am not your Excuse me, can I get a washroom? I just like to be alone sometimes. Nah, maybe. Yeah. Don't you? English. Talk to me, what's bothering you? It's just hard, you know. Like, uh, trying to keep up. It's tough sometimes. I don't know if you understand. You know, you don't always have to force yourself to fit. Mm. Trust me. You don't know what it takes for some of these people to live the kind of life they live. Most of these people live fake lives. But he has motive. And what will his motive be? You, of course, eliminate the competition. I call it the Cain method. It's named after Cain in the Bible. He eliminated his brother. For you guys, if Mark Anthony actually reported Flex, then I'll be very disappointed in him because, yes, I get it, drugs are bad and all of that. But he should have considered Flex's future before he reported him. What if he gets thrown into jail? Then what? Hmm. It's really sad. If it was his own friend Thanos that was caught smoking, and in the Waiter went to report to Shika and Thanos wanted to beat him up. I know, right? Well, since the truth is out now, I think I can go see Mark Anthony now. What? Yeah, he said his dad wants to see me and so they're inviting me over lunch at their house. Like seriously, don't go! <laughs> like that's some childish thing to do. I don't see anything wrong with a female friend visiting a male friend at home. She's not just visiting, she's going to meet his I parents. Ariana. It's your choice. Don't listen to these girls. 
Hey, go be fine, boy. Oh, really, Tiddy? Nice. What's up, Ariana? Why are you ladies up to? Um, I'm going to your former's block to check on something. She is going to stay. Hi, hey, madam. Perfect. That's me. Ariana, you know, we could study together if you don't mind. He's a senior from me at the top. Which senior? Please, I don't know his name, but you call me from the top. Which side? This side. Come and show me which senior it is. the news. What news? Mark Anthony is now the captain of the basketball team. Really? What happened to Flex? Apparently it's a drug issue. Ah. But then it happened during the vacation, so how is that a problem? I think it's because there were other people around, like from other schools, and so making him the captain will not look good for the school. It makes sense. I asked you a question. Please, I brought something to see now, Mark Anthony. What? You me ask now, make you buy something give Mark Anthony. Have I not asked you to stop speaking pigeon with me? I should punish you right now. Yeah, I'm sorry. I was just escorting you to a classroom. That's all. And since when did you start running escort services? You, go. See, for the chill, eh? Why the vex so? Are you still speaking pigeon with me? Come with me. You are still standing there. Hey, for my boy. Are you aware you are late for dining? She's a place where senior code. And so what? Instead of running to you, are walking. I'm sorry. What was that in your hand? Nothing. Nothing? Then bring it and let me look at it. Stop this idea. You beg what? Bring it and let me look at it. There's nothing here. Thinking about you brings a smile to my face, a twinkle to my eye, and a skipped beat to my heart. Wait for me after class, treasure hunter. This is nothing. Hey, just after one time, you're already sending love letters and chocolates to who? To girls. Sister, please, it's not mine. It's the senior that sent me. Which senior is that? See, I can't tell you his name. Otherwise, I'll be in trouble. You are already in trouble. So tell me, who is it? Who gave you this? Madam President, are you done with your house? I told you girls, but you will not. What exactly did you tell us? I told Mark Anthony and Queen romancing themselves on the corridor. Seriously? You be then be asking me seriously. He's collecting your boy. You heard Mark Anthony say he has got to the same Yeah. Grumor has said that she's the one who got to marry Prince Wow. <laughs> Are you serious? I think you should confront him about it. I'm not going to confront him about anything. If he's truly seen her, that's his choice. I mean, it's not as if we're dating. <laughs> I know you don't mean what you're saying. See, I'm very serious. I don't have time for all this drama. My final exam is approaching. I'll just talk to her then, and then I'll find out what exactly is going on. Don't bother. Not necessary. You are sure? I'm very sure. <laughs> so you are just going to give up on the love of your life? I'm not giving up on anyone. <laughs> okay, I'll oh, help you insist. <laughs> Hello, hey, the bees of our time. They never go for dining, always buying food. Really? I mean, what are you just doing here? Oh, we went for dining. We just came to buy some food. It'd be so. Yeah, you girls just sponsor that with some drinks. Eh? You again. Oh, it's a bit too much time, eh? Should we get you some food? Nah, we didn't. Yeah, yeah, yes, yes, yes. Mark Anthony, can I please see you for a moment? Sure. sure. Have you guys heard that Flex and Mark Anthony fought today? What? Apparently it was so serious that Mark Anthony is injured and in the sick bay right now. Oh my god. But some people are also saying that it's rather Flex that is injured and at the sick bay. So which is which? Well, judging by the height and the size of the two people involved, <laughs> I think we can already agree on who is at the sick bay. I agree. <laughs> Tell him Mark Anthony. Seriously, you guys have to go without it. I have to go and check out how to Hey, 
You are going to chalk. Chalky? <laughs> Who is that guy? Which guy? I'm going to check on Angela. She said she was going for some debate test. Oh, I have oh. to make sure it's actually true. Give the little girl some breathing space. Abba. Her parents asked me to protect her, especially from guys. And that's exactly what I'm doing. Don't you think you're being a little overprotective? No. I'll see you guys later. Hi, good afternoon. I'm looking for Angela, former general art student. I know her, but she's not there. She hasn't been here the whole of today. Mm, no, maybe you should check the dormitory. She's not there. Hmm. I hope some boy hasn't yelled her to their classroom or even their old block. All right, thank you. Hey, did you meet her? No, she's not at her meeting, not in the classroom, not at the library. So I'm going to check the dormitory oh. seat to find her. What's that? Oh, um, my mom sent some things to Iron Lady. Why, she not come for the PT? Yeah, she was, but then it's that time of the month, so I needed some parts and provisions. Wow. Some of your parents actually do know and care about your periods. Mm -hmm. It's a taboo to talk about periods to some of our parents. Hey, why? Well, the only person I'm able to talk to about such things is my father. And that's because I need the money to buy the parts. So, I'm able to talk to my parents about anything, even guys. Hey. So they know about my country? Yes, even about flex. Hey. Ariana! Gentleman, you think you are informed to you now, so you've grown with Henceforth, it's Sister Ariana to you. Ariana. Sister Ariana, please hear me out. If you follow us to our class, I'll have the boys punish you. Rubbish. Why did you stop me from talking? You should have let me put her in her place. Relax. A fool is known by his speech and a wise man by his silence. If a mad woman slaps you, Anna, would you hit her back? No. Exactly. At the right time, I know how I'll deal with you. So take your time. What do you want? I want to have a word with Sister Ariana. She doesn't have anything to say to you and she doesn't want to discuss anything with you, so please go. Fine. You have a minute and 30 words. It starts now. Well, left to just me, we wouldn't even go and waste our eyes because they are going to lose anyway. Like, seriously? Do you know the school we are playing against? Do you know how good they are at sports? And with McAnthony as our basketball captain, definitely an L. So you want us to lose because of McAnthony? As far as I'm concerned, it's a school's team, not McAnthony's team. So, what are you talking about? Whatever. I think you should be careful of this Pharisee guy. Why? What if Flex put him up to this? <laughs> so you mean Flex told him I was sick and she take me to the sick bay? No, but he knows that you guys are cool now, so he could influence him to move to you. For a particular reason. Revenge, obviously. Listen, all I'm saying is, you should just be careful. Okay, I will. And why is Ariana? Um, she said she was going to see Mark Anthony, so... Ah, this girl is another hypocrite too. <laughs> In one breath, she doesn't like the guy. Uh -huh. And in another, she goes to the point of every opportunity.